Happy 2020, everyone! <laughs> Welcome to my channel. My name is Crystal, and I am finally getting around to planning my January monthly and weekly. I'm going to do my weekly using this really pretty sticker kit I bought from um, Grace's shop. I'll post her shop down below in case you like, you can purchase. Um, I am no longer in my print pression planner. I will talk about that later. Um, but I still think that these stickers will work just fine for this planner. My mother purchased this planner for me and I am so happy that she did because I absolutely love it. And um, there are reasons as to why I will not be in my print pression planner anymore and I will get into that later. I will also do a video showing you um, more into this planner because it has a lot of cool little areas. So, oh, I'm doing my weekly first. Okay, so let me take off my little clips, get everything out of the way. This is the first time I work in it, so she is not trained to my flat yet, but I don't think that will be an issue. Okay, so again, this, as you can see, is a horizontal layout as opposed to the compression, which is a vertical layout. But I think these stickers are going to work just fine. And we're going to see if I am correct <laughs> now. Uh, maybe I can zoom you guys in just a little. So, yes. So we're going to see how these fit. Okay, perfect. I'm glad that these aren't spaced down anymore because this will cover up the um, day and the date and I don't know if I want to keep it in the black lines or go off to the side I think I want to go off to the side to give an illusion of a bigger space instead of it stopping right there so how was everyone's new year I'd love to hear what you guys did. Mine went really well. It was a nice and laid back um, New Year's. I, we don't go out, don't go to any parties or anything like that. If we have a party, we have it at the house. <laughs> but it's just family. I'm gonna take this one all the way almost to the crease or the center here. Again, it just feels like it elongates the writing area a bit. You have a lot more writing space on this planner than you do on the other. Um, they do chop up your weekend, your Saturday and Sunday. I really like having full days for these, but I think that will be okay. So my Sunday, I guess I'll take to that middle line. Okay, and then I can just write in the dates later. I do want this Pop Fizz Clink sticker to go on New Year's Day. trimmed this right under clink, the word clink, I think this would go really nicely right here. Let me try it. If it doesn't work, then I will just put it on the other side. See if I can write, if I can write straight, if I can cut it straight. Up to round that off. I didn't notice I was shaking until I started doing this video. I haven't eaten anything today and that is very bad. That is actually one of the things that I have to take better care of and I'm going to start a wellness journal. 
or um, planner for this year. Okay, so these actually on New Year's Eve, this one has um, food items, it has some cupcakes. And I want to put that for New Year's Eve because my lovey was so sweet. I told him that I wanted um, Chinese food. <laughs> and he got off work really late, but he went to the store and bought like all the Chinese food that they had. <laughs> and I love him for that. Um, I think it was so sweet. I don't know where to put it. Hmm. Maybe over here on the corner. Like I said, it's going to take me uh, a little bit maybe to get used to how I want to lay out my horizontal spreads. Because I haven't done them before. So, I think I kind of like it like this. I have some space to write underneath right here and up here for any checklists. I'm going to use Monday for my little habit tracker. Since like I said, I am a little bit behind. I'm going to put it over, I want to put it right up top. But I want it to go all the way. Sorry you guys, upside down for a minute. I have not done a video in a while and I feel completely out of it. That's good, and then I can put those little stickers in between there. In between those two stickers. Oh, my camera went really dark. I thought I was not recording any longer. Oh, okay, so I can't get rid of this little sticker. Or a little cut. I keep moving it. It's still, it's everywhere. <laughs> okay. Um, 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 I'm going to put... I can get them. I'm going to put this cute little sticker here that says next week on my Sunday towards the bottom. I like to do that on my Sundays just to briefly write down and that gives me enough space to write down about two events or items um, that may be happening the next week that I need to uh, remember? <laughs> and then, I have notes this week and little things that I want to use. And, um, first I want to put down my, I really love this one here. With the lights in the distance, I think that is so pretty. I can either... Turn it and use it this way. Use it this way, which fits perfectly in the allotted spaces, or I can cut it in half and have two stickers. I'm not really sure. It is both fun and nerve-wracking getting used to a new planner spread, isn't it? <laughs> um, hmm, where do I want this one to go? I love this one, but I'm not sure where to put it. I will come back to that one. So on Monday, I am going to put my this week. And I'm going to try and center it in between the two. I think that's kind of cute. Monday is kind of like my command center. <laughs> um, I'm going to put this week notes. I guess I could have stretched this week in notes. Um, across, but I kind of like it like this. I guess I can play around with my um, setup each week until I get used to what I like. But I like I like the look of that. It's kind of different. Um, and then, so I have. I'm gonna use this one on Friday. So I'm going to kind of touch this one to the corner here because I think it's cute. 
And I wonder if I can fit this one. Nope, not quite. All right, so this one I'm gonna put with my Saturday. And put her way at the, put it way at the bottom. So as you can see, this is real. <laughs> and don't plan anything before I do the video. When I push play, that's it. I go from there. Okay, so this one that I'm having such issues with, I am going to place it here, and I'm going to use it to write my checklists on. I think a Sharpie would do really well on that. All right, so there it is. And I have this one little sticker that says little things on it. With the flowers behind it. And I am going to put it, I would like to put it over this, but I don't like the way the colors clash on that. So we're going to add it to top of this one. I think it goes a little bit better. Sorry, you guys. I have been so out of frame. This has been, like, the worst video I have done. But it's okay. I shall keep going. And this one I don't really like. upside down again. Okay. Okay, there we go. So I did forget that I wanted to use some washi to separate or to kind of black out those lines. And now I'm not so sure if it'll look good or not. Um, I guess I could kind of place it On the side like that. I guess that'll be cute. So I'm going to line that up. I actually like the way this is cut. The washi was cut from my previous use, but it kind of borders that there. And then, what if I want a little piece right there? I'm going to do it. I'll just have one little flower. I'll cut that. Then I do have this black. So I wonder how that will look. Let's see, shall we? Can't find the end. Wow, I really cannot find the end. There it is. Let's see. Hmm, maybe if I did it straight, yeah? It would look a little bit better. black better actually now that I look at it I like the black better than the pink it just shows up a bit more and it really brings out all the black in the images so I'm gonna put one over here and 
even though I said I didn't like it there. <laughs> that looks so weird now though. With that box, I have got to cover that with something. Um, and this one I am going to just put all the way across underneath that sticker. I think that's cute. And maybe this one, instead of going, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take that off. And instead of going just in between the two, I'm going to go above it. It may cover the January Y and J of it, but I think that's okay. Seriously struggling this time, you guys. Gosh. Okay. There, that looks so much better, so much better. Let me zoom you in so you can really see how I'm messing everything up. <laughs> so you can see it up close and personal. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. There and there I need to trim that a bit. Okay, yes. Yes, yes, yes. So happy that at least that is looking good because mm mm mm. I'd like to put some at the bottom, but that's going to, my phone is going crazy, sorry. Cover that box a little bit, I think that's okay. Now these pages are rounded, which I didn't realize would be um, an issue at all. Oh wow, my phone, sorry. So. Okay. Well, I think that that looks really cute, actually. At the bottom, I'm liking this really thin washi. Okay. That looks so cute. I'm wondering if I should just leave that pink. I think I am, just because it's already down and it doesn't really bother me too bad. I'm sure it probably looks weird on camera. Okay, so... Here it is. <laughs> I am wanting to add some stars at the top, but I think it would completely throw it off because of the blue, but I really wanted some moons for certain reasons. Um, that would look so strange. So I'm not going to put that up there, but... But I want it up there. Okay, so I'm gonna add in the dates. So was yes, so this was the 31st, Wednesday. I mean Tuesday was the 31st. Next Monday the 30th, Wednesday. One I'm just gonna write in New Year's Eve and up here. Okay, so yeah, so I'll do the pen um, after that I'm done completing <laughs> through the process and I'm looking at this. I think it is so, 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 so cute. I'm gonna fix my crooked um, stickers there. But yeah, I really like it. And these, I, I was gonna write on this with like a Sharpie, but I have these really pretty glitter pens that my love bought me um, 
they are freaking amazing so amazing i think i'm gonna write on that with it it'll definitely show up because it's so dark and so glittery um i wish i had this in thicker i know i said i was done with oh you know what i have it in white the constellations Again, there's a certain reason why I really want to add some moons and stars on this. You know what? I'm going to cover up where it says January because it'll actually show through. And I love that. Yes. Okay. So happy. I really wanted I really wanted to incorporate um either stars or moons on the spread <clears throat> and I love that it's still gold <clears throat> excuse me now my voice is going out <laughs> uh. Sorry. I want it to line up with the other washi I laid down on the other side. Which is so weird that it wouldn't. Okay. Love, 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 love. Okay, now you can totally see the date and the year up there. I like that it is still there but not in your face. That makes me want to get clear tape with other or transparent tape with other designs on it for all of my spreads. I really like that. But um, if you wanted to do something like that, you could always go over it with um, like a micron pen or Sharpie pen if you wanted to go over it to make it, if you wanted it to stay dark. But anyways, okay, so there we go. I am done with this and I actually really love it, um, seeing it all come together on this horizontal layout I think I'm going to really like it and um, yeah I was going to tell you guys why I did not want to use the print pression anymore and that is because I ordered <clears throat> a cover from them and it was torn and when I put the back of my print pression cover just the backing of the planner itself into the cover it came out ruined there was tons of glue on it and I was really upset and it actually stained and ruined the back of my planner well I wrote them and I was like look I know things go wrong you know especially with mass production you know not every item is going to be perfect so I was completely understanding with them and <clears throat> they fought me every step of the way. Every step of the way. Then they made excuses. Oh, that's not really torn that bad. And it was just ridiculous. I even sent them pictures. Did I already say that? I sent them pictures so they could see exactly what I was talking about and exactly why I was upset. And um, I didn't appreciate their horrible customer service at all it really just what is that saying put a bad taste in my mouth for the company and I'm a return cu uh, customer I bought the planner I bought a clear cover I bought a white um, like pebble hybrid cover um, so it just really 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 disappointed me and I 
seriously do not want to use that planner and talk about it <laughs> and say, you know, this is my profession. I don't, I don't want to say their company name after this video anymore. I don't, just don't want it. And here it is, 2020, start of a new year, start of a new planner. I thought it was perfect timing. And um, so yeah, not that not having my business is going to hurt their business at all, but just wanted to share with you <laughs> why the change because if you see any of my other videos or you follow me on Instagram you will see that that has been my primary little planner I like the size and um, I enjoyed using it but nope no more I'm not going to um, just not going to use it anymore and this one I think is absolutely perfect also for my monthly layout in here I do have um, this kit here that I will be using and we're gonna see how it works in here. Um, I'm thinking that it's going to be the same sizes and actually these are strips so that's perfect. And even if it isn't strips, I mean even if I didn't want it a strip or it doesn't work out because this is a Monday start, I can always put down the strip and cut it according to where I need it. So anyways, that's why I will no longer be promoting them, using them, buying from them. Nope. I would be very interested though in hearing from you guys if you have had any issues from them and how that went in getting it resolved. So I hope that not everyone is having a bad experience because that would just suck. <laughs> Anyways, that's my ramble. This is my layout for the first week in January that I'm very happy that came out this good. And um, I will see you guys next time. If you like the video, a thumbs up will help me a lot. If you want to see future videos, you can click on the bell and you'll be notified for future videos. So yes, I invite you to subscribe and thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.